Hello, oh my lanta, oh my lanta. I took a shower and then I instantly put it up in a ponytail like a bun and I just took it out to film this so it's a little, uh, it's a little messy. But I still sound a little groggy but I feel great so it's just like that lingering like congestion that I have because also I've been in the house for three days straight so as soon as I got outside my allergies just were like, oh hello. My turn, my turn to shine. So therefore, I'm done with my cold, but now I have allergies, and my allergies is congestion, which is super annoying. I never had a fever, I never had a sore throat. It was just like I was just congested, and like I had a slight cough or whatever, but that's exactly what Eli had, so we're all good. Feeling a lot better. I'm finally in the studio. It is Wednesday, and I have the studio by myself, so therefore, there's a, there's a ton that I have to do that I couldn't do at home that I just, I wanna be very, very productive today because I haven't been productive in like, I mean, now that I have been productive I just haven't been as productive as I usually am in the studio so I'm very excited to uh, get that going today so let me let me show you uh, what everything that I hope to do today I yeah let's uh, let's go over my um, my hopeful to-do list there's a ton of things on there, so I'm hoping I get it all done. So let's look over it. Also, it is the last sheet of my to-do list. Um, I have these to-do list notepads on my website available in different colors. And also one that says a yum list, which is like a grocery list. So look how long of a list this is. So first of my to-do list is emails. I did emails yesterday, but I just want to make sure I do them today just to make sure I keep up with them. And then I have to order inventory because there's some inventory that I at the moment I bought inventory which came yesterday which was a ton of stickers but I didn't film it because my mom took it before I could film it unfortunately whenever I bought that inventory there was things that we weren't low on but then due to orders and wholesale I'm currently now low on so therefore there's a list of stickers that I have to now order hopefully they come for the show hopefully next thing I want to do list is uh, the PGH inventory uh, I don't know if you saw my TikTok, but uh, here's the TikTok explaining it. Just, here's the TikTok. So I was already having an iffy day. I'm just going to eat some Wendy's in my studio by myself and just have a good me night. And then I looked over here. Mima, I'm already crying about literally nothing. I look over here. Look at here. I spelled it wrong. I spelled Pittsburgh wrong. I forgot the R. Oh. Guess what? It wasn't just the mouse pads that I spelled wrong. This is what I get for being overwhelmed and ordering inventory at 2 a.m. Also puzzle zoo. So with that, as you saw, um, my mouse pads and my puzzles, and then also didn't show my TikTok because I didn't get it yet, um, I got license plates, which I got today, but I didn't see them. Uh, they're also spelled wrong. I don't know what I was thinking, or I don't I don't know when I ordered those, but I, uh, I ordered them and they were spelled wrong. So therefore, I have to reorder them. Luckily, I only got 20 of each. And people on TikTok are like, just sell them as like discounted, like special editions. Like it'll be like an inside joke. And I'm like, okay, so I might be doing that. Um, but as of now, I want to make sure that I have the correct spelling for the show because mainly they are for the show because it's in Pittsburgh. So then the next thing, the next thing on my to-do list is price check, which is I have to send my mom a whole list of every single inventory piece that we're bringing. Subject, no, category, like prints, stickers, magnets, pins, all of that. I have to send her all the prices so she can start making signs. And then next is a the TAM sticker, which is just Anna's friend. Um, I had to make him a sticker real quick. It'll just take like 15, 20 minutes, hopefully. And then I have to make a wedding frame for someone, which I already have the frame done. Like, it's not a frame, but it's like designs on the outside and then you put it in a frame. But I just have to put someone else's name in it uh, for my mom. And then um, next is at least two to three designs and upload those designs. So that's everything. Oh my gosh, my ears are now clogged. It's so, ugh, I hate my ears are clogged. Ugh. I didn't even have any of these when I was, when I had a cold for the last three days. Now it's just like my allergies and it's so annoying. Anyway, they should be gone within like the next half an hour because I just got to the studio, so. Anyway, and then, did I say upload designs? I have to upload the designs. So, um, this is the, this is what I have to do today. And it's already 1.30. So, stressed, a little bit, a little bit, so. I did get my morning meditation drink though. I'm like super late, <laughs> but I got it. Well, let's get it going. I gotta do emails first and then order inventory. And then, 
I'm probably not gonna get to drawing until like 6 p.m. Stressful. I miss, I miss being productive. I mean, not that I wasn't productive for the last two days, but three days. Also, I got tickets to the Jonas Brothers. I think we're in like the sixth row, the row F, sixth row, in the middle. I'm gonna freak out. I'm gonna, fr I'm gonna cry. I'm gonna cry. I'm going with my friend Bridget. Uh, I'm going in Connecticut. <laughs> I live in Pennsylvania and they are coming to Pittsburgh. But unfortunately, um, the day that they're coming, Anna, who I normally go with, um, she will be working. So she can't do anything that's like during the week, which is unfortunate. So my friend Bridget, who lives in New York City right now, she possibly will be moving to Boston and then we could go, I don't know. There's just all up in the air, but I know that I'm going to the Connecticut show. So I'm so excited, like, so excited. You have no idea. I already went to them in 2019 and it was like the best concert ever. And that was like, we weren't really, really that close. And this time we're gonna be super close and I'm so excited. And then also, which I didn't realize was the same day, I also bought um, Billie Eilish concert tickets for Pittsburgh. So I am super excited. Like I'm gonna cry so hard. I'm gonna cry, I'm gonna cry, I'm gonna cry, I'm gonna cry. I'm gonna cry. As of right now, my aunt does not know this, but I bought three tickets and we have pretty good tickets. My aunt Deb, she loves Billie Eilish too. Anytime she's at the studio like by herself, she just listens to Billie Eilish. She listens to Billie Eilish at home. And I thought it'd be fun to like be like a thank you for like working so hard for my business. So me, her, and Anna are gonna go. I'm hoping Anna can go unless she's on a show or a movie, then she can't go. But then I would just have another ticket for someone else. Either way, very excited. Today was already a whirlwind of things. And now I gotta do some emails and get on. I just, have to, I just get started on this. I just gotta get started. So come along my, the rest of my day. Cool. Okay, goodbye. Okay, so this is what I created and Anna, her friend needed something like with his initials, which is T-A-M, and he wanted it to kind of look like this in a way. So this is what I came up with. I hope he likes it and I will just wait until I receive an approval or some edits or whatever. So I kind of had to make it up like how the letters would look, but I think it, it looks like it's the same font, sort of. So glad I got that done. I got my emails done. I ordered inventory as you saw. I did the price check already with my mom and I just finished the TAM one. So next thing is I have to do the PJ inventory and then the wedding frame and you know the rest of that and it's only four o'clock so progress 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 Look at that, I finished every single thing on my to-do list today. You know how amazing that is? Do you know how amazing that is? That's amazing. I'm so excited. <laughs> and, oh, I look rough. And as for, and, I can't talk. And as for right now, I'm going home. It is 9.30. I went to leave about two hours ago, but I was like, I need to finish this to-do list. I only had like two things left to do, so I didn't, my camera's about to die, so I will see you. Hello, what day is it? Thursday? Thursday? Yeah. So I had a really productive morning. I got up earlier than my alarm because I felt a lot better. So my body my body was just like naturally waking up to what it normally wakes up at, which is like 6 a.m., which is never, never was the case even a couple months ago. <laughs> but I did all those things and I had to go to Michael's and stuff like that. So I'm finally at the studio. It's about 12.30 now and I'm a bit behind on the day, but I just like took my time. I actually finished my YouTube video, which is good and stuff like that. So today I have to do like one friend custom order and then another one that I was like, oh yeah, I could just do real quick. Probably shouldn't have said yes to it, but I did. And I meant to do it last week, but I didn't. And I was gonna do it a couple days ago, but then I got sick. So now I'm gonna do it today. So, and then hopefully I get to do the project. I'm just gonna do a lot of drawing today. So hope you enjoy that. So let's let's get my day going because I need to and I'm a bit I'm a little bit behind, but it's fine. So we're fine. My allergies are so bad today. <laughs>
let me do a little explanation about this piece. Well, I did this one about six years ago, I think, yeah five or six years ago. And this is a pretty low quality photo of a drawing that I did in prism markers and sharpie marker. And as you can see, this is how I used to do cats. I mean, this is this is where I started. Let's just say this is where I started. So the person that got this wanted me to draw her other cat in the same exact style so it matches whenever she hangs up on her wall. But I was like, Ugh, okay, I'll attempt. Okay, also, printer is turning off right now. So just ignore that. Um, I was like, Ugh, okay, um, sure, I'll try. I'll try. So um, this is what she gave me. I, I remember doing this. It's just I haven't done this style in a very long time. So I was like, yeah, totally. I could do it. So this is the cat that she wants me to do. Look, he only has one eye and he's so cute. He reminds me of Jack so much just with one eye. He's so cute. So this is her other cat. So she wanted me to draw the same style, but this cat. So at first, this is what I came up with. Just the color, no background yet. And then I added just the background. And then I added these. I <laughs> personally would never choose these again, but for it to be matching the old drawing, I had to. So I did it on this side because the original one is this side, but I thought if she were to put them side by side, it'd be kind of cool if these were on the other side. So it kind of like mirrored it, but I don't know. I gave her the options so she can let me know uh, which one she wants. Oh, and then as for this one, um, someone's mom just on Etsy was asking if I was doing the canvas pieces anymore. And right now I'm not doing it because I'm very, very busy. But I did tell her, I was like, I could do a print of the black and white pineapple and then just, you know, make a print of it and not a canvas. And she was totally cool with that. So I made my alcohol ink. I just realized I had to fix that. I already printed one. So um, anyway, but once I started doing this, I kind of got carried away and I made a few new prints for the show. So as you know, I just did this one. And so I just kind of went with it and just did some more for the show. The ones that I thought might look kind of cool with the like colorful background. And then I turned my yin yang into a print like this. So these will be up on my website after June 8th. So I don't know when you're watching this, probably around that time. I don't know, but I'm just going to wait to do these. I'm just going to wait to put these up on my website and I'm going to do much, much more. I just wanted to start out with these and then I'm gonna print them and put them in the print bucket for the show. Glad I got that done. As for my to-do list, that's another story. So uh, as for my to-do list, I only got two things done. Yesterday was super productive. Today was not as productive. I mean, it was productive. I did a bunch of things. It's just I didn't get to do all the things. So, which is fine. I got two big things done, so that's good. So I will just tackle the rest of it tomorrow. We'll figure it out, but it's nine o'clock. I'm gonna go home and I'll see you in a few seconds when I wake up tomorrow. Goodbye.